21 minutes and two I gotta go, so I told that girl I'm gonna slaughter this. Hey guys, and it's me, and today I am testing out body markers. Since I love art, and sometimes I just don't feel like drawing on paper, so I'm drawing on myself. Let's get on with the video. So first, first I will be testing out these ones, which are by Bic Body Markers. And then I'll just talk to you while I draw some flowers on myself or something. Let's uh, swatch them on myself just to see how the colors look. green one <laughs> the pink the dark blue the black The light blue. The purple. The red. And the orange. So that's all the colors there, and shade, because that's not color. But, yeah, they're pretty bright, and it's got a nice drawing time. And, yeah, so let's get drawn, and then I'll have to draw further up my arm for the other ones. So I'm just going to draw a simple flower. gonna make it nice <laughs> bold make it one of those medallion ones or something And then we'll test out which ones wash off faster, if I remember. So there's that flower. Now I don't have all the sets, but like, I've got a good amount. It's a veiny flower. It's very weird. And you can blend them too. Which I'll test out after I do this flower. Not my best work, but it'll have to do. Alright, now we'll test out the blending power between the light blue 
in the dark blue. So here's my swatch of the light blue and we'll go in halfway over top with the dark blue. Fill that in just like that. Now we'll blend and now we go back over top with the light blue. And look at that! It's all blendy. Oh yeah. Now you have a gradient on your wrist. And a flower. <laughs> Woo! And then it dries just like, you know those dollar store tattoos that you can buy that are temporary? Yeah, they can crumble like that off of your skin too, but like it lasts a little longer. So now let's go to the sink and show you how it looks while you're washing it off. Now you will be able to hear lots of cars, so just be aware of that. See, it's waterproof for certain amount of time. So you need to kind of scrub in there with your nails and stuff and it starts to get lighter. That's after washing with my nails and making my wrist red. But it does come off eventually, so you just gotta keep trying. You can see the colors coming off with the soap. This is a little painful. <laughs> There's the result of the third wash. And there's the result of scrubbing it off with a towel. Now I'm testing the tattoo pen by Stylo... Oh, I know that. They're washable, so these ones actually come off really easily. So I'll just... I'll swatch all these colors just like I did with the others. And yes, I'm using the same wrist, but I'll just do it up here. So there's the purple. And they all rolled away. Yay! <laughs> okay, I'll just leave them in a different spot. There we go. Here's the green. Ooh, nice and sparkly. the blue. You won't be able to see the silver very well. Sparkly. Here comes orange. Oh yeah, look at that glitter. <laughs> And the pink. So there is all the sparkly pens there. Should we use a stencil? Oh yeah, I feel like going for the rose. Let's stick that on there. Right 
here. Let's get Rose Dip and the whole butterflies and shebang. Let's make the rose purple with some pink highlights. Alright, let's see if it does layering or if it just doesn't work together. Oh, it kind of looks like a galaxy. I could make a galaxy rose. Alright, let's see if it does layering or if it just doesn't work together. Oh, it kind of looks like a galaxy. I could make a galaxy rose. Oh, it doesn't look like it works too well together. Oh, well, there's the purple and pink rose. Let's try it again. Oh, it's just taking it off. Oof. Well, oh, that's great. Oh well. I'll just get those off there. Let's try it again over here. Alright, this time I will be setting down the pink highlight first. And then I'll do purple and then I'll do oh, blue. There's the purple and pink oh, rose. Looks like let's it kinda try it again. The beginning of the pen. Oof. Oh. Oh well. I'll just Get those off there. Pink. Let's try it again over here. Alright, this time I will be setting down the pink highlight first. And then I'll do purple and then I'll do blue. Oh, looks like it kind of messed up the beginning of the pen. Alright, now for the blue. And let's see how this will look. Let's see how this one will look. Pink. I almost feel like the pink looks better with the blue. Alright. Let's reveal it. Now a little bit of purple, and then I'll do blue for the outer petals. That doesn't look... Yeah, that looks, um, interesting. Let's find another stencil to work with. What about this butterfly? <laughs> Alright, now for the blue. And let's see how this will look. Let's see how this one will look. I almost feel like the pink looks better with the blue. Alright. Let's reveal it. Ooh, so satisfying. <laughs> Look. Yeah, that looks um interesting. Let's find another stencil to work with. What about this butterfly? <laughs> Let's try swiping your finger out. across it. Now, these won't take very long to wash off, so I think I'll just end the video here with... Let's I like the orange and Bic markers a lot butterfly. better because they are a lot smoother to draw with and they definitely stay on longer, but 
Their colors are vibrant and you don't have to worry about sparkles everywhere. So that is the conclusion to this video. So thank you for watching and I'll see you. Poke that like button in the side. So there's the so like a person. And I'll see you guys in the now next video. Orange, Bye! Which...